Christmas Maokai. I mean Winter Maokai by Sita Duncan with music from DJ Kavi at Newgrounds. Eep, book, blink, blink. Not so hasty there. Don't judge me. You don't know what trees really sound like. I don't know what trees sound like either, but I'm going with Treebeard for safety. After uh, reading through some of the comments on my Sumo Graga skin thread, someone suggested a Christmas tree or a winter Maokai, and I decided to try my hand at him. It was definitely interesting doing this character. He's a little, little bit more detailed than Gragas. Just a little bit. I think my total time was, was a bit longer as well. At first I thought I'd go with ornaments, so it would be cool to see, you know, rolling and exploding at people in glittery dust of death. And of course, if he's he's a winter Maokai, he has to have a new, new ultimate, which would be a train set which would go around him whenever he cast it, and I know that would just be all kinds of fun. I decided instead of ornaments, it should be a pineling. Perhaps even a decorated pineling with glue and glitter. Obviously, if Mokai was going to be a winter Mokai, the presents in his roots would have been under the tree originally. This music is kind of awesome. I grabbed it from Newgrounds, from the amazing person who did it, and I think it's fantastic. It's like Tim Burton Maokai Christmas or something. I tried to make his little hand all cheerful, but it just kind of came out looking menacing, even though it has a fluffy red hat on. But, oh well. Using the grayscale again to put in details. I'm like, this guy looks a little bit too much like Kogma. He's trying to mess with his chin a bit. I'm like, he's not a Kogma Maokai face. That would be a weird skin. Putting some pine needles in there for fun. Lighting up his star, which I should have. For funsies, I could make like alterations to the star, like Star of David Maokai Winter, Winter Maokai. That train set was something else. Like, I understand that it would be cool for his ultimate, but I hate it a little bit because I kept having to fix it because I didn't draw it quite right. But in the end, I think it looks pretty sweet. That's right, train set, you obey. Oh yeah, along with the beard, you get some big scraggly eyebrows to make him look more cheerful and jolly, I thought. I don't know, it might just look, make him look scarier, who can say. Any moment now, I will start adding color. There's the color, yay! The image is becoming a lot more fun now. I started with the teal on there, then added on the star. I had to restrain myself from using too many colors, because I always enjoy extremely- Oh, and there I go anyway, I'm putting the lights on the tree. I use like every color in the book, never mind. The red and green train doing some of the smoke. I think his hand would probably be pretty scary in game. If he mistook it for his face or something, like one of those crazy butterflies, I don't know. In either case, the pine wings would be awesome. I don't know if they just had like little tiny legs that chased after people, or maybe they bounced. <laughs> Who can say? Well, I hope you enjoyed watching the Winter Maokai Wannabe Art Spotlight by Sita Duncan.